Chris, are you ready for your pitch? I've been spending a month on this company, so I sure as hell hope so. Awesome. Okay, so everyone, for those of you who don't know, Chris Seifel is amazing. You should also follow his Substack. He organized the FinTwit Summit recently, um, and that was an amazing event. I was listening to, I was re-listening to a lot of uh, those presentations uh, earlier today. So uh, we are we are in good company. So Chris, take it away. I appreciate that. Uh, so for those of you that do somewhat follow me or know what I've been up to. Um, I've been, I guess, all over semiconductors lately. Um, it's really been the sector I've been focusing on. Uh, two weeks ago or so, I sent out a pretty quick uh, piece to all my paid subscribers on a company called Kulik and Sofa. Uh, Kulik and Sofa, I'll refer to them as KNS. Uh, they're the they're a advanced packaging and disassembly equipment company in the semiconductor space, and. My original thesis has kind of been blown up because the stock has moved 20% in the past two weeks. Uh, but with that being said, uh, the thesis is pretty simple. So it's a uh, $3.5 billion company right now. Uh, they're trading on about 18 times uh, forward earnings or year-to-date earnings. Um, I'm having them at 17 and a half uh, next 12 month earnings. Um, and when you look at the thesis, uh, really what it comes down to is that they are a leader in uh, not only just packaging in general, fire bombing, which accounts for 80% of all uh, semiconductor packages, but also for advanced packaging, which carries higher margin and which is where the entire industry is moving towards. Uh, so uh, if you haven't heard, there's a chip shortage right now. And because of that chip shortage, there is six to nine month lead times uh, for the equipment companies. And so what that means is that for the really first time uh, in quite a while, the company is able to have visibility into its uh, forward sales. So into 2022. Um, so on one hand, you have really this backlog of demand uh, that the company is just cranking at a high utilization rates or full capacity, uh, trying to meet the demand of the fabs and the IDMs, which are also operating at about 96% utilization, which is, uh, about 16% higher than what you would be uh, kind of in a bull market. So uh, this company is uh, not only the leader in this equipment space, but also uh, there are just massive current uh, tailwinds for it in terms of the supply and demand dynamic, but also moving forward, you have you know, 5G, AI, um, IoT, et cetera, which is all changing the entire landscape uh, around the semiconductor business, you know, Applied Materials just had their investor day on Tuesday or whatever it was, and they're seeing just more stability and less cyclicality in business. So uh, with that being said, uh, the company has finally achieved a $1 billion revenue run rate, which is kind of their threshold to achieve operating leverage. So um, in talking to the management team, uh, the quarterly uh, expense structure for them is about $53 million of fixed costs plus five to seven percent variable um, costs, really depending on uh, what chip shipments are and what revenue is for that period. So uh, with that being said, you know, they're now at a place where they are, uh, they have 22 and a half percent around uh, operating margins. So their return on invested capital is about right now 24 percent on 10 percent cost of capital. They're investing, uh, call it 50 billion, 50, 500 million dollars a year. Um, they're just going to keep compounding growth like that. So I have this company right now at 33% upside um, over the next 12 months. That's great. Awesome job. Good a stuff. A Matt, is that the is that the ticker? A Matt. Uh, the ticker is KLIC. A Matt oh, oh, was a sorry. different right. company. KLIC. KLIC. Sorry, I, I was just trying yeah. to catch the ticker, and I didn't. I never. Can you, I, can you I was trying to keep it short for everyone, but a uh, big part of the thesis too is that technically it is breaking out. So it's a very high probability uh, bet right now. I, I'm jumping in, my man. So I appreciate it. I'm, I'm already levered to the gills, so I can't. <laughs> you can.